and they're ready to go. Set at the 600, favourite box two. They're off now. Lockenvar Hugo jumped okay. Just got tightened up in the early part of the field and he's back near the end. Showing good speed was forced exit. It leads down the straight the first time from Tahiti Pearl to second. Followed by Lime Burner Dixie. Back on the inside, Mr. Shire. Lockenvar Hugo's got it all to do from back there. And the last one was Negan Express. Down the back, forced exit the leader by four. Tahiti Pearl trying to wind up. Mr. Shire running on well. And then Lockenvar Hugo. G might be too far back. The favourite as they turn. Forced exit's running a huge. Huge race, Tahiti Pearl, Mr. Shire, Lock and Var Hugo, they're closing now. Mr. Shire grabs the lead. Mr. Shire too strong. Mr. Shire, home over the top, has got up to win from maybe Tahiti Pearl second. Thirds a photo between Forced Exit and Lock and Var Hugo. Long gap then to Lime Bernard Dixie. And Nigan Express one of the last time, 34.79. Well, he finished too well, Mr. Shire. Gee, yeah, uh, the six dog there, forced exit, ran a huge race in front. It ran a fantastic race. The six, one, six, four, two. Mr. Shire, good to see him back in the winner's circle. It's been a while, but he's had a few problems, this dog. We know he's a real talent when right. He's won five from six over this track and distance now. And he's powered home late. One, six, four, two. After the running of race number nine, one six four two, thirty four seventy nine, one and three quarters by ahead the margin. One, Mr. Shire, trained by Robert McCalcom. Uh, Robert McCalm, I beg your pardon. Robert McCalm, the winning trainer of Mr. Shire, by Magic Sprite out of Slick Exit, and uh, he's been a little bit too good here. Overcame a little bit of early trouble to win. One six four two.